Hello. Welcome back to the channel. Did you miss me? I missed you guys. I know we missed a couple of weeks, but you know, my cousin got married. I went on vacation and I just could not get to uploading those two weeks, but we're back to finish off this series. And I can't believe we're already on the letter W and yeah, we're like almost done. So I decided let's go with the Caesar dog, the West Highland Terrier, because I mean, look at him. He's so freaking cute. So <laughs> without further ado, let's get it started. The West Highland Terrier, commonly known as the Westie, is a small dog breed that originated in Scotland. Westies are believed to have descended from various Scottish Terrier breeds, including the Cairn Terrier, the Dandy Diamond Terrier, okay, I haven't heard of any of those breeds, and these Terriers were primarily used for hunting small game such as foxes and rodents, which makes sense. In the early 19th century, selected breeding began to produce a distinctive type of white terrier that would later become the West Highland Terrier. The breed's white coat was favored to ensure their visibility during hunts, and they were highly valued for their tenacity, agility, and ability to work in rough terrains. Colonel Malcolm of Poltalog played a significant role in refining the breed, and the West Highland Terrier was officially recognized in 1904 by the Kennel Club in the United Kingdom. West Highland Terriers are known for their lively, outgoing, and friendly nature. They are often described as confident, affectionate, and spirited dogs. They are quick to make friends and are generally good with children, although they may not tolerate rough handling. They possess a keen sense of curiosity and can be independent at times. The West Highland Terrier gained popularity not only as a hunting dog, but also as a companion pet. Their charming appearance, lively personality, and adaptability to different environments contributed to their widespread appeal. The breed's popularity extended beyond Scotland, and they became highly regarded across the United Kingdom and other parts of the world. The West Highland Terrier has a well-defined breed standard that outlines its desired characteristics in terms of appearance, temperament, and structure. Breed clubs, such as the West Highland Terrier Club of America, really long name, were established to promote responsible breeding and maintain the breed's integrity. Present day, the West Highland Terrier remains a popular breed worldwide. They are known for their distinctive white double coat, pointy ears, and a lively expression. Westies are cherished as loving companions, and their adaptable nature allows them to thrive in various environments, including apartments and suburban homes. West Highland Terriers are energetic dogs with moderate exercise needs. They enjoy daily walks, play sessions, and mental stimulation. They have a natural instinct for hunting and may display a strong prey drive, so it's important to provide them with safe outlets for their energy. Westies are generally healthy dogs, and some of the health conditions that they could get are allergies, hip dysplasia, and certain eye problems as well, along with, of course, any other specifics. But on average, the lifespan of a Westie is around 12 to 16 years, although some may live even longer with proper care and a healthy lifestyle. This is the finished painting, and I love how the fur came out. I am really glad that I went with the technique at the beginning of the painting. Um, it took a long time, but I think it was worth it, and I hope you guys enjoyed it, and I'm glad to be back. If you like this video, please like this video, and I'll see you on the next one.